Hi. So one of my favorite things to do with Control Rig is take animation and do what's called a backward solve. So that basically takes the animation that is like from motion capture or uh, Maya and you can convert it to a backward solved onto the Control Rig itself, onto the controls. So you can animate these controls afterwards. And it's really simple to add an additive layer in Control Rig to then make adjustments. In this case, uh, so we're gonna we're gonna name the source. This is the base controls that we we just converted. Uh, here is the, the additive source. We'll call this uh, add. And we can go in, we could find, for example, like the head. And let's say we wanted to animate this on top of the animation. This could be for corrective motion if, you're, if your mocap didn't have the character looking in the right spot. Um, the, the arms were poking through something. Lots of reasons why you'd want to take the source animation. You know, maybe you animated Maya and then when you brought it in, you made some changes and it doesn't something doesn't line up. So you want to just tweak it, right? You just do an additive tweak. But the problem with this is people have said, okay, well I did this, but now I need to bring in the source again. I need a new source, right? So how do I how do I replace that source without losing all my additive curves here? So you can actually create a new section. Let's go back to the beginning. In this case, we wanted absolute because we wanted to be the actual keys. Um, we can see here. We can mute the source. You can see here it's just the head by itself, right? Um, we go to the new source. We're going to make this a run. We just name this. So you can tell what's going on. Uh, right click in the timeline, and you see this import anim sequence into this section. What this will do is it will automatically do your backward solve and put those channels right into the timeline. So now he's running and you see the head animation is still preserved. So we've basically uh, re removed the old animation. Let's mute this. Here again we have just the head. Uh, this is the source. Let's unmute it. And we also have the new one. And you can then delete the source. Um, but you're keeping all of the adjustments. Um, now, if you did FK, an FK um, solve, then it would all be FK. If you did the uh, um, the backward solve in the control rig, then they all have to be the same. You can't mix different types of backward solve, but this is a great way to update your existing source animation with something new. Um, so hopefully that helps you guys. Thanks.